Hello everybody, it is me, Jurassic Master, here to say that uh, today we are doing a breakdown video of the new Monster Hunter movie that just came out. I know it came out like two, three days ago. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, I'm just sorry. I'm sorry I'm late on making the breakdown for this. I know I'm going to try to have it that I get it on time and we may get a new Godzilla trailer coming out soon, which I am hyped and excited for. So be ready for one on Christmas or day after Christmas, most likely on Christmas. I'm going to try my best to get on Christmas. I can't promise anything, but let's get started with this and let's start it from the beginning. Uh, play. I'm, I usually, I always play the trailer but first and then I break it down. So let's get started with this. I believe that the answers we both seek lie here. Remnants. Ancient civilization. Guard their technology with the most fearsome of creatures. Now, you ready? Any second now. So that was the trailer, and let's break it down. I'm very, very excited to see this movie. I cannot wait to see it. So let's go from the beginning. Uh, I don't think there's anything really at the beginning. Um, I just want to make sure. I don't want to miss, make sure I miss anything. So we got that. I don't know. No, we got nothing there. You ready? I saw Toho was making this, and I got really, really excited because Toho is the one, the people who are made the Godzilla movies, the very first Godzilla movie that came out in 1951. These are the people who are making it, and I am so excited. They did a great job with the old Godzilla movies. I love them. They're so good. I just, I don't know, something about them I just find really good. I can't break down what this is because I don't have enough... I can't really tell what it is. So I can't break that down or what that thing is. But I'm running off a bow, which... We got, we got this one. And, I mean... We're about to see a better picture of it. So, he says it's Diablo. Uh, and that is not Diablos. This is Diablos. This is him. This is Diablos. Now, Diablos has a lighter brown, like a light brown. And as we see here, it has a little bit of a darker color. Is there another picture? No, that's just what we see back close. But. This Diablos has a darker color. There is a darker color that is called Black Diablos. I'm just looking at this Diablos, and I'm thinking that looks pretty much like the Diablos. I mean, look at the head right here, and like how the horns and color is, and look at the color and head here. That's clearly Black Diablos. So, that is Black Diablos, which I'm... I haven't beaten Black Diablos. I've beaten Diablos, which was a little hard. 
uh, good thinking on breaking the horns. That is very good. And then you gotta do the other horn and the tail. I have played Monster Hunter. Oh Nessela. So, I didn't know what the heck Nessela was. So, apparently, this is Nessela in the older games. I have only played Monster Hunter World and starting to play Monster Hunter Iceborne. I've never seen this thing. Maybe it's... And it looks, it looks crazy. I love how it has, like, the crystal on the back and how it looks right there. I, I think that's pretty cool. Okay, so we get this Rathalos. Oh, he looks like he's on something right there. So, I see this and it's blue. What do I think of it when it's blue? That is an Azurian Rathalos. I mean, look at the color there. That That's a clear blue. And look at the color here. That's clearly a blue. So these are, this is a male So I'm wondering if they're so I'm wondering if they're gonna start a turf war with uh Azurian Rathalos and regular Rathalos. But by the looks of it Diablo and Nursing. Diablo I love that. Uh, uh. Smart. <laughs> That's always funny. So I think that part right there is when they get like the fang of the spider, probably, to like take it out, take out the, the Diablos, and that's them trying to catch it, he kills it, next time you're the bait, I think that's where they're battling the Rathalos, and, or blue, ra, uh, Azurian Rathalos, because if you look, Right there, it's got a little blue tent to it. So now we get... Let me... So we get our first look at the handler. And who's the handler in the game? Why, this is the handler in the game. And do I find her annoying in the game? Sometimes I do. <laughs> so we get this big guy right here. And who is this guy? Well... In the game, he is the Admiral. Now, you can see that he's, his hair looks a lot like Goku. 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 I mean, look at his hair here, and look at his hair here. Not exactly the same, but they basically are. So, yeah. Also, this guy, right here. Nope. Right here is the field guide leader and you can see that he has his sword here his sword right here as well so that is the field guide character or the field guide one <laughs> so we see the red rathalos here, but we're going to see him right here. This is, well, I just said it, but this is Rathalos. Regular Rathalos. Here is a better shot of him, of how he looks. Not his uh, logo or tribal looking one. But that's how he looks right there in the game. That's how he looks in the movie, which I think he looks pretty cool. Look at that handsome fella. Oh. And we still we get this one. Oh, baby. If you don't know who this is, this is Kashara Darura, the Tornado Twister, or Tornado Dragon. This is a uh, Elder Dragon in Monster Hunter World, and he is hard. He makes twisters in the game, and that's probably why that lady is there. If you didn't see the first trailer, that wouldn't make sense. I would suggest seeing the first trailer as well. I didn't do a breakdown on the first trailer because I, it was so late. So I'm just doing it on the second one. And yeah, but if you don't think it's him, look at his head here. Look at that. I mean, that looks pretty much like that one. 
but just not as fearsome looking. They both do on, go on all fours. I saw this thing and I was like, what? They're bringing that one in? I was so, I was so excited. And I was like, bruh, pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Look at him, goodness. Let's do this. But that's the cat. I don't really want to talk about that. So I think the movie's going to start off with like how it started from the first trailer where it has them all uh, uh, starting to enter this like uh, enter the desert and then a storm hits. I think the cause of the storm is going to be because of him. Because in the game he causes twisters and in the game or in the movie, it looks like he caused a twister there. So, I think he's the cause of it. Then we're going to go to the part where we see this thing for the first time. Like, basically, we're going to see this thing for the first time. We're going to... We're going to see, like, it for the first time. I feel like everybody in our crew is going to die. And she'll be the only one surviving. Then the the guy will come in and basically defeat the monster, or almost defeat the monster, and basically own it. And then she is going to be wanting to be like, "Hey, can you teach me how to do all this fancy stuff?" Hence the part where it is. So this scene right here, where. It basically showing them training and doing all that. I think it's going to start off with that. And then I feel like their training will be interrupted by Raffalos just coming in and just coming in and attacking. And I think that's the part where we're going to hear the dude say... Um, where we're going to hear the dude say... Uh, this. Absolutely. I think that's where we're going to hear the part where he says Rathalos, and then later, I feel like Rathalos is going to run away and go hide for, like, until halfway to the end of the movie. She's going to get all this new armor. Then it's going to be, and then they're going to probably going to get the uh, now I see the spider and try to kill the like finish off the Diablos and that will bring us into the nighttime scene where it's dusk right here and they'll defeat it then I think it will go to we meet the rest of the characters or meet the rest of the crew like the Her, I think we're going to, later, we're going to meet her, and we're going to meet that other dude, and then, at the finale, it's going to be them all, I don't know who that is, maybe just another extra character, I think it's, I think that big guy is this guy, and the handler, well that's obviously right here, right there, and I think the only way to go back to the reality world, or the real world, not the Monster Hunter world, but her, her world, I think they're going to do that, and then, then we're going to be treated with the scene right Absolutely. here. We're get, they're about to, I feel like they're going to be running up to it, and then we are going to see this blue Rathalos. And once that blue Rathalos is about to die, I feel like we're going to see the red Rathalos, the normal one, the normal one, and then once they're both defeated, I feel like the big final boss of the movie is going to be this one.
and that will determine that'll basically make or break uh, if she does make it through the make it through or if she chooses to say hey I've really enjoyed being here with all of you people I think I'm going to stay but yeah those are my thoughts theories on how the movie's gonna go and a breakdown of the move or of the movie uh wow congratulations you made it to the end of the video thank you so much for watching the full video i want to thank you so much for watching it i hope you guys enjoy my theories and my breakdown on this video and remember that uh diablos is a fun crazy it's a fun battle uh remember comic-con is going to take over the world and marvel and monster hunter should have a crossover thank you so much y'all goodbye <laughs>